welcome back to Kimmy's Kitchen. Today I will be doing the pizza dip that I talked about in a previous haul, uh, the Dollar Tree and Aldi haul. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and get to show you all the items that you'll need. Okay, um, today I'm gonna be doing a small version of what I normally do for a pizza dip. Um, so I'm just gonna use a small casserole dish. Um, if you're gonna be doing this for a group, a large group of people, you may uh, wanna use a larger casserole dish. Okay, um, some cooking spray. You will need to spray down your casserole dish really well um, because it's cheese and it sticks. So, uh, I use marinara. Okay, and grated Parmesan. I'm using just a small block of the, I'm using a half a block of the cream cheese, but typically I will use a whole block or if there's more people, I'll use two blocks. Okay, I think I showed you the Italian seasoning. Okay, and mozzarella cheese and a shredder if your cheese is not shredded. Um, sometimes I buy the shredded and if it's cheaper to buy the block, I just buy the block and shred it. It's not a big deal. All right, and um, set your oven on 375, okay? So I will make this and then we will, I will put it in the oven and we'll do a time lapse of it in the oven and let you see what it looks like when it comes out, okay? Okay, so yeah, make sure that you spray your casserole dish. All right, and first you're gonna put in the cream cheese. And like I said, I typically make a much larger um, portion of this. Um, my son loves to eat it, my daughter, my husband. I mean, it's a big hit. I've made it lots of times for um, his friends. So, my son's friends. And they seem to really like it as well. So basically you're just gonna spread the cream cheese really good at the bottom, that's gonna be your first layer. Um, because I am making a small portion of this, I'm going to put each item in um, one time. But if you are making a large casserole dish of this, you would actually layer it um, until everything is gone. You'd layer it several times because you would of course be using um, more portions of it. So first goes the cream cheese. Let me layer it, spread it out in through there. Really good. So that it covers the entire dish. Um, so let's see. Oops. Okay. So it's gonna look like that at the bottom. And next, you put in your marinara. You can use pizza sauce. I use pizza sauce. I use marinara. It doesn't really matter. Um, it's to whatever is to your liking. Okay. So, of course, marinara. I'll put a little bit of um, the Parmesan cheese. You can also, um, I'm using the mozzarella shredded cheese, but you can also put in, um, you know, whatever kind of cheese that you like. And also, I have seen where people also um, put in pepperonis, um, but I do not do that for this recipe. Okay. And then sprinkle some of the Italian seasoning in there. Just kind of sprinkle it throughout. Get a good coating in there. There's that. And now I'm going to just go ahead and shred the cheese. Okay, so I will be doing a time lapse of me shredding the cheese. Okay, so of course you're just going to put the Mozzarella cheese on the top, spread it throughout so that it covers everything evenly. And 
And I do go back through and um, put just a little more parm on here. A little more Parmesan cheese and a little bit more of the Italian seasoning. Okay. And this is what it looks like. And like I said, this is a small version of it. Typically, uh, I make a big casserole dish, but this is my daughter. She just wants a little today for lunch. So, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put it in the oven. the pizza dip and it's gonna be yummy I actually went ahead and made another one for my son because they both my daughter and my son went at some so they both will have the individual um, containers and uh, if you guys enjoyed this just comment down below and let me know if you make this and add anything different to yours besides the pepperoni that I talked about comment down below and let me know that also and I hope you guys have a blessed day Bye, y'all.